Hey guys, welcome back to the Love and Lace YouTube channel. Today I'm making the Sandra Swim Thong. It's a reversible seamless style and the pattern's available to download in my Etsy store. I'll link to that below. Let's get started by taking the front outer and back outer pieces and placing them right sides together to sew the gusset seam. I'm using an overlocker. If you don't have one of these, you can use a regular sewing machine with a small zigzag stitch. Now do exactly the same with the front lining and back lining pieces. Again, placing them right sides together to sew the gusset seam. Now unpick a few centimetres of the seam that you've just sewn. This hole is where you'll reach inside your garment to turn it back to right side out. Place your outer and lining pieces right sides together and sew the leg openings. Attach swim elastic as you go. Now reach in through the waist opening to pull your garment out to the right side. Sew the side seams with right sides together. Ensure that you're sewing through only two layers of fabric, matching front outer to back outer and front lining to back lining. There's no need to attach swim elastic here. Mm -hmm. 
Turn your garment out to the right side and lay it flat on the work surface before you sew the other side seam. This is just to make sure that your garment doesn't get twisted in the process. Make sure your garment's right side out and then reach in through the hole in the crotch that you unpicked earlier. Take hold of both the outer and lining fabrics at the front waist. Holding onto both layers, pull the fabric through the hole in the crotch. You just want to pull enough fabric through to allow you to start sewing. Maneuver the fabric slightly so that it's right sides together and match up either the centre front notches or the side seam. I'm using a pin to hold it in place which will make it a little bit easier. Now sew the waist in the round with your overlocker and attach swim elastic as you go. You'll find that your garment's encased inside itself this is totally normal, you just need to shift the fabric through the channel as you sew. You'll need to take care here that you're only sewing through two layers of fabric and you're not accidentally sewing through the fabric that's inside the channel as well. Here you can see what your garment should look like when it's all trapped inside itself. Now you should manoeuvre the fabric until you can locate the hole in the crotch again. Reach inside the hole to pull your garment back out to the right side.
All that's left is the hole at the crotch. I like to hand stitch this closed using a blind stitch. And that's it, the Sandra Swim Thong from Love and Lace. Hope you found this helpful. If you did, please like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.